Joseph's wife and kids were a blessing. These are the things that were happening here in his life as they were passing through. The people who served the king, some of them, the servant of Joseph, when he went to go tr- meet the brothers, his countenance changed. Why? Because he served someone who his countenance was humble and was full of grace and love. You'd be surprised on how a little love can go a long ways and how our countenance, people watch us. They might not know the and understand the fullness of why we are the way we are, who we are, but yet it still influences those around us. His brothers and dad's heart being restored during this passing through Egypt. God's hand was over them all through it all. And guess what? Our perspective, as we've been going through this life of Joseph, our perspective has changed. As we have journeyed with him, our lives will never be the same. Understanding how he went through and how every life was important in this, pa- in this process, in this journey from one place to another. We were able to see the grace of God and his mercy upon his family and the love passing through Joseph, the forgiveness that he had. Because if he didn't forgive, he wouldn't have been able to do what he did for them. Bring them into safe passage. Prepare a blessed land for them to stay while they were even in there. And having his boss be right along with him in this plan. Amen. We got to give God glory for all of that. God set it up. God made it all ready for them. So we cannot discredit the little things. Everything leads up to something. There's always a breakthrough after a struggle. So don't get stuck in where you're at. Just know that it will turn. Say this too shall pass. And guess what? We're just passing through. 